Most advice you get about North Las Vegas, it's complete shit. And in this video, I'm gonna set all that stuff straight so that you can decide for yourself what it's really like to live in North Las Vegas and if you think it's somewhere you wanna live in 2022. First up, be prepared for all of the funny looks you're gonna get, looks of people who think you're an absolute idiot when you tell them you live in North Las Vegas. Now, I've gotten these from my family, from my friends, even from a couple different bosses. My most recent example is the fact that my sister-in-law now lives with my wife and I, and guess what? She and her father both thought, oh, they live in North Las Vegas. They must live in the ghetto. Well, guess what? We don't live in the freaking ghetto, and North Las Vegas is not all some crime-ridden wasteland of a Western civilization. That's completely untrue. I don't know why everyone thinks that. People will look at you like you're crazy, but don't believe me, go to crimegrade.org. The, the link is down in the description. Go to that website and check out some of the crime in North Las Vegas and check out how it compares to other parts of the city. And I guarantee you, you will be surprised. North Las Vegas is a pretty stinking super quiet part of the city. Granted, we are close to Nels Air Force Base, so you do get some planes, some fighter jets flying over top. But besides that, every once in a while, because it's not even an everyday thing, uh, you really will notice how super quiet parts of North Las Vegas are. I live in the northwestern corner of North Las Vegas, and like I said, super quiet. Great neighbors, lots of kids playing in the street, no race cars, no gunshots, there's no fireworks every day. The, I hardly ever hear a police fire siren or ambulance siren. It's super quiet here. Additionally, there's really no traffic in North Las Vegas because you actually don't have a major freeway that runs through the center of the city like most other parts of Las Vegas. And there are also no large entertainment venues for concerts, outdoor concerts, amphitheaters, stuff like that. There are casinos and things that hold concerts, but you're not gonna run into any outdoor, like super large concerts that are gonna be blaring music until three, four in the AM on the regular. Another thing that just debunks that ridiculous stigma that North Las Vegas is a horrible place to live is the fact that for the entire six years I've been living here, the builders in the area have been building more and more brand new home communities. Now, these communities are absolutely excellent. I've toured several, I have videos on several, I've talked to clients about several. These homes look just like homes in Summerlin, in Green Valley, and in a bunch of other parts of the city that everyone likes way more because they're so much nicer. Well, they're all full of shit. In fact, let me give you some examples of all the new homes that are built here in North Las Vegas. Up on your screen now, you should probably see a map of North Las Vegas from newhomesource.com and you're gonna see a bunch of new home developments. We bought our home, it wasn't brand new, but we bought our home, I think it was 2019. But anyways, we bought that house for $333,000 and now it's worth about $450,000, which is a crazy improvement. Now, I know this is happening in a lot of areas of Las Vegas, it's happening all over the country, but still, for a crimeless, lawless, or excuse me, crime-filled, lawless wasteland, don't you think $120,000 in equity in a year and a half is a pretty damn good deal? Yeah, I thought so. Finally, I want to talk about availability of restaurants, entertainment, and all kind of shit like that. A lot of people move to Las Vegas specifically for the restaurants and entertainment. In fact, Las Vegas is a city based almost solely on tourism. So you have the Strip, you have the Old Vegas, you have different parts of Summerlin and Henderson that completely or almost completely cater to the tourism industry. North Las Vegas does not really cater to the tourism industry. Yes, there are some hotels here, there are casinos in North Las Vegas, but it's nothing like the Strip, it's nothing like Old Vegas. I told you guys already, it's very calm here, pretty relaxed, pretty quiet, and that really, you're gonna get that feel throughout most of North Las Vegas. So keep that in mind, there are not as much uh, places for entertainment, restaurants, that sort of thing, here in North Las Vegas. There is a strip of road called Craig Road, which is uh, where a lot of the restaurants and stuff kind of conglomerate. And I'll also throw up another map and highlight a few other parts of North Las Vegas with really good restaurants, um, not really so much entertainment, but grocery stores, just all the things you need. Now, like I said before, we live in the upper and northwest corner of North Las Vegas, and we've always had all the grocery stores and entertainment and restaurants, everything we need really close by. Like, you gotta check out LVAC, you gotta check out Winco. All of these things have always been close by. We've never had any problems getting anything that we needed. So don't think that just because you're living in North Las Vegas, which is an outer rim community and a little less developed as far as entertainment and stuff like that goes, that you're gonna have a problem getting the things that you need because you won't. 
If you don't completely hate my content by now, please go down below and answer this simple question in the comment section. What do you think about North Las Vegas? What have you heard? What kind of stuff is going through your mind right now? I would really love to hear it. It helps me make videos and it helps me make all my content better. While you're down there, if you still like my content, please hit that subscribe button and that like button. There's some videos down in the description that I think you should watch next. And there's also some stuff popping up on the screen. So click on one of those and go check out what else uh, I have to say about North Las Vegas. Thanks for watching guys. See you later.